In this video, I'm going to tell you how to maintain the pump, the most critical part of your pressure washer, and how to keep it going year after year. I'm going to show you real quick how to do proper maintenance on the pump on your pressure washer, and it involves this little bottle of fluid, the uh, Power Care Pressure Washer Pump Protector. Now, in theory, you're supposed, you only really need to use this stuff at the end of the season, but because this thing is so expensive and this bottle is like 10 bucks, I'll put a link below to Amazon. This is really all you need to do to make your pressure washer work for years and years. So what I do is I've already shut the water off at the hose delivery and you'll see there's going to be a lot of water in this thing and I don't want you to wait five minutes for the water to drain out. So what I'm going to do is just gently undo this hose and it'll spray out a little water and get me soaked of course. All right, going swimming here. Okay. All right, so easy enough. I'll get the pressure side of the line out of the way. And critically, I'm going to unplug the pump. That way we don't have any bad, exciting things happen. And what happens is this bottle here Actually, I'm going to remove this wand so I don't whack myself in the head and you get a good laugh. But uh, if you come in close here, you'll see there's this green liquid in here. And what you do is you're going to put this on the, the pressure washer. Now, if you've got something to help you, it makes it much easier to do this. But just by yourself, you tilt it over and you screw it on here. Just like that. And then you simply unscrew the pressure line. Oh, let me make sure that's depressurized. And these things can be hard to remove because most people just leave them on. But to make this work correctly, you take this off. And now you can hear a little bit of that uh, sloshing in there. What I do is I tilt this up and if you come over and look right in here, what I'm going to do is start squeezing the pump, or this bottle, and I'm going to start squeezing and you want to look right here. Okay, and see the, just a little bit of, yeah, let's, let's film here. So can you see this? Okay, so I'm going to squeeze. You can see just a little bit of water coming out. And I'll keep going. And the moment it turns green, I can see it's green. I don't know if the camera can, but I can see the fluid is green. That's it. That's all you need to do. When you come down, you loosen this just a touch. Tilt it over so you don't pour half your bottle of pump preservative out. And you can see that green dribbling out there. And that's literally all you need to do to maintain your pump on your pressure washer. Some people say that they, they screw this in and they press like crazy and it's super hard. But the trick is to put that on there with the pump, tilt it this way so you don't pour out half the bottle. And then once you get that in there, tilt this up, begin squeezing, and the pump is off. And you begin squeezing, you'll see just a tiny bit of green comes out, and that's all it takes to maintain your pressure washer so this unit runs year after year. I have the Ryobi 2000 PSI thing, and I've already just done this driveway all day. Check out the other videos about the surface pressure washer and the review of this thing and everything else. But it went from this black, gunky, disgusting uh, driveway to something that looks like gorgeous concrete. And that is literally all you need to do besides getting a rag and just clean this guy up, of course. Clean it totally up, get all the junk off of there. Put this fluid in there. I do it every time I use it. Only well, takes me two minutes to do, but this thing has been running for a long, long time. I'll put a link below to the cleaning fluid, and that's it. My name's Aaron Linstow. I'm a professional reviewer and like to bringing people these type of videos. And oddly enough, I'm a polar explorer. Check out links below to check that out. And if you found this video please helpful, please like and comment. And if you found it really useful, subscribe to the channel. Thank you very much for watching, and enjoy your pressure washing.